Hey YouTube, so I'm just here with another quick haul from my favorite scrapbook store um, downtown. So today I ended up spending $24.61 with tax. So um, I've been seeing all over YouTube for a while now um, about Project Life and I wasn't really sure what it was so I've been kind of researching it the last few days and it seems like something I would really enjoy doing. Now I'm going to do my best to do it every day. Um, I'm kind of doing it on my own terms, not on, you have to do it once a week, once a month, by theme, whatever. I'm just, I don't know. I'm just going to try and do it every day and just take, like, random pictures of part of my day. Like, today, I ate watermelon, so I took a picture of the watermelon. Um, so, just, like, different stuff like that. So, I figured I'm going to go ahead and start today. Um, in terms of, it's, I guess it started by Becky Higgins, but I'm kind of doing my own version so, in one of the other hauls, you guys saw that I had got this album at Joann's for $5. So, the same, it's like one of the same ones that Becky Higgins use, uses. So, I'm going to be using this album to at least start with. And then today, when I went to the scrapbook store, I picked up two of these. They are by We Are Memory Keepers, and you can see right there, all... The different sizes and there the designs so um I guess with the Beggy Higgins a lot of people use one that's similar to this but it's got three slots down the middle but anyways I like this because it has all different um, slots and pages so I really really like that so I they only had two so I went ahead and got both um so when they get more in obviously I'll get some more so and then Obviously, we all have way too much paper already, but I went ahead and picked up a few sheets to kind of get me started on this, uh, my version of Project Life. So, let me do this collection first. Okay, this is all this collection. Okay, so I'll start with this collection. This is not new paper, um, but it is the um, Simple Stories. What? fabulous collection. So I thought this would be really good. Um, it's all kinds of cute stuff. So I got this. And I got two of these. Because on the back it has all different stuff. So I got, you know, two of these. So there's the back. Um, gosh, I don't even know which is which. So, okay, yeah. So I got two of those. Next, I ended up getting two of these. Be true to you. It's just really cute um, little fun stuff that I thought would work really well in the book. And here's the back. This is me. Fabulous. Me documented. A little typewriter. So I thought it would be really, really cute. So two of those. Um, I got this sheet here. All different bingo cards and then that's the back. I already know that I have tons and tons of paper that will match this collection. Okay, and then okay, and then this is a different Simple Stories collection. This one is called Yearography and I love this to punch out. It's kind of in the same color scheme. Like I said, I'm just doing this on my own terms, kind of doing whatever I like. And that's the back, which definitely matches that collection. Next, this is the also yearography, and I just love this. Today, details, enjoy everyday life. I mean, here's all the uh, months. So, really cool journaling card. So. And this one actually says, Live, laugh, 24-7. There, now you can see it. It's not black. Okay, and the remaining paper I got is just kind of random sheets that I picked up. This is from the This and That collection by Echo Park. I love these to use. I mean, how many pages can you use this on? Look how many. I could use this throughout the entire book. So, I thought that was awesome. There's so many things on here. And then the back is around. Next, this is from also the This and That collection. Um, I just like this in general. 
just stuff that you can kind of cut apart. So, yeah, so I got that, and the back is super cute also, with the blue or the yellow and white stripe. Okay, this is the Dear Lizzie Neapolitan. Look how cute. I have not seen this. I know it's not new, but look how cute. I love it. So I'm definitely going to be using this throughout the, um, the project life. Next, I got this. I just really like the print, the airmail one. And this is by Crate Paper, and it's called Storyteller Documented. This is the back. It's blue, and it's got like a elevation type floor plan, kind of. And then here's this. Love this side. So anyways, like I said, so I'm going to be starting it, and I've already got my sheets in here. They're all different ones, all different designs. So thanks for watching, guys. Oh, and I forgot to tell you how much I spent. I spent $24.61, so not bad, even though it's not the Beggy Hickens one. It's my own version, and i rather do that. I don't like copying people, and I don't work well from kits because I'm always changing it. And I kind of just like wanted to get some new paper and then use what I already have in my stash that I haven't been able to use yet. So anyways, thanks for watching, guys, and um, please subscribe if you're not, and comment, and I will see you a little bit later. Bye!